Tony Cornell, the 12-year-old daughter of late singer Chris Cornell joined the band One Republic on stage live on Good Morning America Today, where they performed a moving tribute of the Leonard Cohen song Hallelujah. The performance was a celebration of the lives of Cornell and late Linkin Park frontman Chester Bennington, both of whom died earlier this year within months of each other. Slideshow Sam Shepard, Jean Moreau, Chester Bennington and other notable people lost so far in 2017. It's an honor to perform this for my dad and Chester and to sing for them, Tony Cornell said. Cornell and Bennington had been friends for years, touring and performing together many times in the mid-2000s. Bennington died on July 20, the same day that would have been Cornell's 53rd birthday. Bennington's death is being investigated as a suicide, according to the Los Angeles County Coroner's Office. Cornell took his own life in May, according to the Wayne County Medical Examiner's Office. Chester Bennington and Chris Cornell inside the close bond they shared Chester Bennington celebrities react to Lincoln Park frontman's death Lincoln Park was scheduled to perform at Central Park today as part of the GMA Summer Concert Series, before Bennington's death. One Republic took a detour from their ongoing nationwide tour to join GMA in place of Lincoln Park and celebrate the legacy of Bennington and Cornell. One Republic told ABC News it was an honor to pay tribute to their beloved colleagues. Chester sang this at Chris' funeral, and this is arguably one of the greatest songs written in the last 50 years, One Republic frontman Ryan Tedder said of the song Hallelujah. It's a very special song to us, and I think to most people and especially to Tony Cornell as well. ABCnews.com video One Republic and Tony Cornell perform moving tribute to Chester Bennington and Chris Cornell in the wake of Bennington's death, Lincoln Park announced on the website for their charity group, Music for Relief that all donations would now be directed to the One More Light Fund in honor of Bennington. Cornell and his wife founded the Chris and Vicki Cornell Foundation in 2012 with the mission of protecting the vulnerable children including those who are homeless, in foster care, or victims of abuse and neglect. Many fans who are still reeling from his death are celebrating his life by supporting his philanthropic work. Drug abuse and suicide prevention resources to find out how to get help for you or a loved one fighting against mental illness and addiction, visit the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration website or the National Institute on Drug Abuse. If you are in crisis, please call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-TALK-8255 or contact the Crisis Text Line by texting TALK to 741741. ABC News' Michael Rothman contributed to this report Film Magic Getty Images Chester Bennington of Stone Temple Pilots performs, April 10, 2015, in San Francisco. Chris Cornell performs, December 13, 2015 in Los Angeles.